When I think of paan, the first thing that comes to my mind is the Banarasi paan. Did you know that Banarasi paan is a GI tagged product from 2023? So, what are these GI tagged products? It is Geographical Indication Tagged Products. The government of India here issues GI tags to a product that is produced and manufactured in a specific geographical region. This product should have the special quality and characteristics that is attributed to the place of origin. We are here at a GI tagged store. This is the first GI tagged store in India and it is in HSR Bengaluru. Geographical indication is a form of intellectual property protection. GI was introduced to maintain the authenticity of the product. It also contributes to the preservation of cultural heritage and the economic well-being of the local communities. I see that these are both Orissa Patachitra paintings. Exactly, exactly. Uh, can you please explain the difference? Sure ma'am. It's a 70th GA product of our India. Usually in Orissa Patachitra, they use two types of canvas. One is cotton cloth, one more is tussle silk. This cotton cloth, it's a layers of cotton cloth. They pasted the cotton cloth with the help of tamarind seeds glue. And they polished with the rice powder and stone. So that it, it comes in a stiffness. And one more canvas, as I said, it's a tussle silk. They painted on tussle silk. Okay. okay. And here colors which are used for painting are naturally extracted from flowers, fruits, vegetables and stones as well. Oh, so these are the natural products from vegetables. Exactly, vegetable. exactly ma'am. Oh, okay. And I see the tree of life uh, here. Uh, this is also the 70th uh, GI product. Exactly ma'am. But this is a symbol. It uh, represents the connection between heaven and earth also. Oh, okay. Sure. okay. Thank you. Thank you. The history of GI around the world is a complex and evolving one. There are many interesting examples. The Champagne region in France is famous for its sparkling wine. In 1891, a legal battle known as the Champagne case helped protect the Champagne name, ensuring that only wines produced in the Champagne region of France could be called Champagne. Switzerland introduced legislation in 1915 to protect the use of the term Imontol for cheese produced in the Imontol region. What is this? It's a kind of musical instrument, ma'am, which is used by uh, Bastar tribals in Bastar. Okay? It okay. makes rain droplet sound. It is also from Bastar, Chhattisgarh. Okay. Oh, and it is also the 63rd uh, GF. Yes, oh. oh, wow. Really, really nice. You want to try? Yeah. At this side, next side. This is really amazing. This shop has so many beautiful things and these murals are beautiful. Who has so, painted them? These wall paintings are done by our famous Magar Naik's, Mr. Magar Naik Orissa artist son, Mr. Prasanna Naik. Ma. Prasanna Naik. Oh, okay. He's a famous Orissa artist of our Orissa Patachitra. Oh, and how many days did they take to Just took three to four days for all floors, ma'am. Oh, that's real quick. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Geographical indications are protected and regulated by various organizations and agencies around the world. World Intellectual Property Organization is a United Nations agency. It assists member countries in developing legal framework and best practices for the protection of GIs. European Union Intellectual Property Office manages the registration and protection of GIs within the European Union. In December 1999, the Parliament had passed the Geographical Indications of Goods Act. This Act seeks to provide for the registration and better protection of geographical indications relating to goods in India. This tag is issued 
by the geographical indication registry managed by Ministry of Commerce and Industry. This registry is located at Chennai. The UNESCO is not directly involved in GI registration, but it recognizes the cultural and intangible heritage value of certain GIs, contributing to their preservation and promotion. Countries often enter into bilateral or multilateral agreements to recognize and protect each other's GIs. A few famous ones are Paris Convention, Madrid Agreement and Lisbon Agreement. This is Chennapatna Toys and this is Etikopaka Toys. So uh, for me, I mean, it looks like a similar. Can you please uh, explain to me the difference? This is Chennapatna. It is from Karnataka. This is Etikopaka that is from Andhra Pradesh. Similarities is they use both ivory wood and the color is natural uh, vegetable dyes. That is what they both use. And the history when it comes to us, when the reason Vijayanagara Empire, the king of Sultan dynasty has been ruling on that time they has to give some work to the employees of the areas where village people used to work and they get to be feeded for themselves on that time it got introduced and then then when they got the kingdom empire got ended then the people start migrated and they just divided with the boundaries when then they some people were stayed in karnataka that they has called as chanapatna they moved to andhra pradesh like the border of karnataka they named it as etikopaka but the making is all same there is a quite difference when it comes to et etikopaka it's a theme based means like mother carrying baby wedding mantapas or else like forming pair like that it comes when it comes to chanapatna it's completely a product based like vases toys visuals, key bunch, bangle. This is what the major difference when it comes to Chanapatna and Etikopaka. Oh, that's quite an interesting story. Thank you. Thank you. This is the Parani Panjam Rhythm. I mean, imagine getting Parani Panjam Rhythm in Bangalore. This is the 350th GI tag, the product in India. Well, this says it is a Sanjeevni flower concentrate and I, I'm quite intrigued. I'm going to buy this and try it. These boards are pretty self-explanatory. Now here it shows 69th, that means Konak stone carving was the 69th product in India to get its GI tag and there's a whole lot of information regarding that. Is this the first and the only store in India for GI tag? Yes ma'am, the concept is unique only. So we have created unique uh, platform for all GI tag products under one roof. So this is the only company, not only in India, maybe you can say world also. Mm. Okay, this is an unique initiative started by Mr. S.J. Tejas, who is the founder and CEO of the company. Uh, we have created a single platform for all GI tag products. Oh, that's wonderful. When was this store started? Uh, it, the store started, the company, it is an organization actually, okay. started in 2016. That's yes, nice. ma'am. How many such stores are there in Bangalore or in Karnataka or in India? Ma'am, actually, currently we have only one store here, so in HSR layout. And, uh, I, I did see the painting of our honored uh, president and uh, Mysore Maharaja and uh, Mrs. Sudha Murthy. So, all of them have visited the store? Yes, ma'am. Every year, what we do, uh, we conduct an event actually when we introduce new products. So, every year during uh, November, December time, we we, we uh, conduct an exhibition uh, where uh, uh, our artisans and uh, viewers also visit here. Oh. Okay, and uh, uh, last year uh, the exhibition was uh, inaugurated by uh, Honorable Mysore Maharaja. Oh, that's wonderful. Yes. Oh, okay. And uh, the uh, Rashtrapati uh, Ma'am Draupadi Murmu, uh, Madam purchased from our website. Oh, yes, she purchased uh, uh, Kanchipuram silk saris and the Kullu authentic uh, Pashmina stones. Uh, Sudha Murthy ma'am, she also visited our store and she was very happy. She also, she appreciated us and she bought a uh, lot of things from us. Oh, that's wonderful. Yes. Do you keep updating the store with new products? Yes, ma'am. Every year, uh, one or the other state uh, will be getting the GA tag products. Uh, that means GA tag status for those products. So, uh, definitely, we keep on adding the new GA tag products to our uh, store. So, recently, we introduced uh, Kota Doria saris uh, and the Dharmavaram silk saris, the holy socks. So, so many varieties. And uh, Paintings also. We introduced Ipan art from Uttarakhand and uh, Cheriel painting from Andhra Pradesh and a few of other. 
and handicrafts uh, we introduced kushmandi wooden mask from west bengal so so many products we introduced so our website is www.gitag.com where people can shop authentic indian gi tag products from us you click any product we have mentioned everything about the product as well as gi information gi information means the the product when it got gi the gi status and uniqueness because every product should to get gi status the product should be unique okay uniqueness we have mentioned uh, and the gi number application number and when gi status awarded for that product and from where we are procuring the traceability really nice talking to you uh, thank you so much thank you ma'am thank you this tour was definitely a lucky find for me as it houses a beautiful collection of gi tag products from all over india under one roof do like follow subscribe and share the through yi lifestyle